Thank God I brought a ton of booze. There's Gina. So here's our campsite. This is all of us. Look at that view! Oh. So we got people everywhere. And I think it's official we have more toilet tents than we do camping tents. That's awesome. We were just talking about how we wanted to see him. Let me see if I can get up close to him. No, they're just scared. They're not? So anyways, look at him. There they go. Here is the Barker house. Barker Ranch, sorry. And this is Charles Manson's house, foundation. Just pulled up and some type of house. And over here is like a little, a little farm or probably where he kept all the humans in the cages. And then way up here travel all through that that and then here's the house so they burned this down when did they burn this house down 2009 All right, we are about two miles away from Geologist's cabin, and uh, we came all through back in there, and uh, this is our view.
we went to geologist cabin. We're setting up camp. This is the closest place we could find remotely that was good enough. Um, there is a ton of donkey shit everywhere. So we're setting up camp here. It's not bad, it's pretty good. Campfire will be here. Tents are all going around. Um, but look at this. So this is our backyard for today. Boom. Fucking amazing. So, geologist's cabin is over there. And we traveled all of that and came in through back over there. So I think we traveled about 40 miles, 40 plus miles. And uh, uh, the striped buttes are right over there. That is the striped buttes. And uh, it was a pretty phenomenal day today. I mean, look at that. Good Lord. We got our fire. Warm up my coffee. Yeah. So, uh, no, we're getting all of us are all the way around. We have Jeeps all the way around there. So, we're all set up. And this is uh, feeling pretty damn good. So, very, very successful day. Um, where that light is way up there, that's where a geologist's cabin is. And that's where we came down here to find a spot. Um, since we have 18 Jeeps, we couldn't fit up there. So uh, we came down here, we have a good spot, and we're good. So uh, let's get some dinner started. And then uh, we're calling it a night because it's been a long day. And then we will continue on tomorrow. So see you guys tomorrow. Okay, I'm just being honest. This is gonna be a little bit narrow. And everybody, seriously, take your time. Because it does get a little narrow. The problem is it's, it's tough to adjust the distance. 
Beautiful. There's the donkeys. And here's all of us. And there was two. Still going up, but it's fucking beautiful. officially done all of our trails and everything. I feel nasty. Um, the Jeep is filthy. Um, 
but we're done. So we did 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 miles worth of trails and we were all, I mean, way up there. Even on, we overpassed those mountains to other ones. So we were at Trona getting gas. Um, and then we're gonna go back to Trona Pinnacles, about maybe 10 miles, not even that, five miles, um, and camp out there because we loved it so much. Um, and then, what else? Let me go home tomorrow. That was a badass trip. So it was very cool because we had some guys that were, um, and girls, had um, that were not experienced, um, no experience. Lucy just bought a 2020 Jeep and she's never done anything. She has, she hasn't even made her first payment on it. And she's out here in Death Valley doing amazing shit. So I'm very proud of this group. Um, communication, everything was, was amazing. Um, so a lot of fun, nothing bad happened, knock on wood. Um, so a lot of fun. So uh, a very successful trip and uh, as much fun as I had, I am excited to get home tomorrow and take a shower for like an hour. But uh, let me show you this. So there was mud all along the way. I'm still at like 12 PSI. Um, she's dirty, but uh, very successful trip. So anyways, hopefully next time, if you didn't make it to this, uh, you can make it out and uh, get some more trips in, so. All right, it is 6.30 in the morning and that's us down there, Turn of Pinnacles. And I wanted to show you the sunset. So I'm sorry, sunrise. So this is all of Toronto Pinnacles. And um, if you ever come here, you can drive through all these trails and you can camp anywhere you like. So it's kind of nice that there's no designated camping spots. Um, you can just, wherever you park and you want to camp there, by all means, go for it. So, um, we are, uh, just getting up, get some coffee, get some breakfast, and then we are out of here. So we're going to drive through here, um, and take some photos with the pinnacles in the background. And then, uh, after that, we are out because my ass needs a shower and I can't wait.